Welcome to iLecture Online. The next type of word problem we're going to deal with is the word problem dealing with age, age-related problems. Typically, two or three people and their ages are related to one another, and those types of word problems take a very special technique. So here it is. Here's our first example. Mary is four years younger than Bill. In 10 years, Mary will be four-fifths the age of Bill. How old are they now? So what we need to do in this case is find some relationship between X and their ages today and then do it again 10 years in the future. So first we start with today. And so we're going to write let X equal. Now we're going to let it equal the youngest person today. And since Mary is younger than Bill, we're going to let X equal the age of Mary. But we have to write today we have to be very specific x represents the age of mary today not 10 years from now now if x is the age of mary and mary is four years younger than bill then bill must be four years older than mary so let x plus four equal the age of bill today now in this problem they give us another relationship between their ages in 10 years now we write in 10 years and the relationship is that Mary will be four-fifths the age of Bill. So Mary, or Mary's age, I should write, Mary's age will be equal to four-fifths Bill's age. Now that is in 10 years from now. So if we write that into an equation, if Mary's age today is x, then x plus 10 will be Mary's age in 10 years, and that will then be 4 fifths Bill's age in 10 years, and Bill today is x plus 4, so in 10 years it will be x plus 4 plus 10. So now we're ready to solve this equation for x. The first thing we want to do is get rid of the fraction, so we'll multiply both sides by 5, multiply the right side by 5, and you can see here on the left side we get 5 times x plus 10, and on the left side, of oh, the left side, on the right side, the 5's cancel out, we get 4 times x plus, and 4 plus 10 is 14. Okay, now we can distribute, so we get 5x plus 5 times 10, which is 50, is equal to 4x plus 4 times 14, which would be 56. Now we move all the x's to one side. So we get 5x minus 4x, because the plus 4 goes across the equal sign, becomes minus 4. And here we get 56 minus 50. The plus 50 goes across the equal sign, becomes minus 50. Now we reduce single terms. 5x minus 4x is x, equals 56 minus 50, which is 6. And so x equals 6. Now we'll go back and see what x was defined as. And x was defined as Mary's age today. So that means that Mary today is six years old and Bill is four years older today. So six plus four would be 10 years for Bill. And that is how it's done. 